Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In today's video, I will show you the best uh, settings for Distance Horizons mod. As you can see right now, I'm in the Minecraft 1.21.1 and uh, everything's working just fine and uh, I've got no issues with FPS and I'll show you how to actually get it. So let's get right into this. The first step for us is to actually allocate more RAM. So let me show you how to do it. But uh, before we do that, I want to tell you that uh, all download links for this mod are down in the description. So if you want this mod and uh, mo more stuff, just click on the link. Okay. So first of all, go, first of all, go to the installations, go to the fabric loader 1.21.1. Where that's where uh, I installed the uh, Distance Horizons mod. Hit edit hit more options and here under GVA arguments, as you can see, I have got 16G, you may have 2G, okay? So 16G means that I've allocated 16 gigabytes of RAM, I have 32 uh, gigabytes of RAM. So if you have 32 gigabytes of RAM, as like me, uh, use 16G, if you have 16 gigabytes of 16 gigabytes of RAM, use 8G, if you have, have 8 gigabytes of RAM, use 4G, uh, just make sure every time you use 50% of your RAM's capacity. The next, next thing we should have is the chunky mode and the chunky mode is designed uh, to optimize and manage chunk generation in the game. So the main function of this mode is to pre-generate chunks quickly and efficiently and that will improve your performance. So what we are going to do now is to freshly load your world, turn off distance horizons mode and turn off shaders. Once you do both things, open up chat, type in slash chunky. Oh, one sec, let me just use a free. Okay, let me use a different word uh, since there were some errors. So press F3 and as you can see, uh, our X position is 17 and our Z position is minus six. Okay, so you need to type in one sec, let me just slash chunky center. Okay, I forgot. <laughs> It, okay, so let's just chunk it, center 17 and... Okay, finally, we can get to the best uh, distance horizon settings. So, hit escape, go to the options, uh, click on the distance horizons mode, make sure that you enabled rendering, so make sure it's true. And set the render distance either to 64 or 128. So, if you have got a really low-end PC, you should probably use 64. It's still okay, as you can see in here. It still looks great, but uh, uh, if you've got like a medium end, let's use 128. Uh, CPU load, make sure it's aggressive. Now go to the advanced options, graphics, render quality, and set max horizontal resolution to two blocks. And also make sure that you use vertical quality and horizontal quality. Okay, where is it? Okay, never mind. One sec. Let's let let's use medium on the vertical quality. And now, when you try that, you can see everything's working just fine, and you've got additional FPS, so it should work well with your low-end PC. So, thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. I hope I have helped you with this. If yes, please make sure you comment uh, this video and uh, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to my channel.